Huh. What was that? Uber, why are you freaking out? We, where, where am I? What, what's going on here? Guys, I'm... Uh, oh, no. What, what's going on? This doesn't look good. Was I, was I sick? What happened? Cody Maverick killed you, my lord. You would still be dead if it wasn't for Blooper. What do you mean the Cody Maverick killed me? Blooper, you saved my life? Doc, what's going on here? Yes, it's true. Blooper found you and recitated you and kept your heart beating until I got here. He is a true hero. Oh, Blooper, thank you so much. Like, I don't know what we're... Wait, Blooper! I thought you... Didn't they capture you? Did the Cody Maverick and the Professor capture you? What would they do to you? Where are they? I'll kill them! Oh my gosh, Blooper! Please tell me they didn't hurt you. Are you okay, buddy? You escaped! Oh. Well, that's, that's good. Oh my gosh, I, guys, I'm like... I don't know what's going on. I just, I guess I'm still a little groggy. Is that normal, Doc? What do you think? Yes, that's normal, considering you did just die and all. It should all start coming back to you shortly. You were passed out for about four hours or so. Blooper never left your side. Oh, Blooper, you're such a good baby. I couldn't ask for a better one. And I'm so sorry I let that evil Cody Maverick and his oh, annoying Professor Pickles henchman take you. It'll never happen again, I promise you, Blooper. Ah, uh, Harold. What's it look like out there? What's the damage? It's not good, sir. Conch Command is in ruins, and we had quite the death toll. Go find Daryl out front when you are feeling up to it. Oh, boy. I don't know, Blooper. I think I'm just gonna go back to bed forever. I, mean, I failed the Conch Command. It's blown up to pieces, apparently. So many people died. I, I just don't know what to do anymore, Blooper. What do you think? <laughs> Blooper, you're so right. The tides do always rise again. And just like the tides, so will the tide changers. Because who are we? The tide changers! That's right! Alright, Blooper. You come with me. We're gonna go find Daryl. Thanks, guys. I... You know, I will take it easy. I know I gotta rest, but I, I just gotta go get a grasp on how serious the situation actually is. Alright? Um, I'm assuming... Is this my stuff in here? Alright. Just grab this real quick. And then we'll be on our way. Alright, that should be good. Get those. Oops. Alright, let me just get these over here, Blooper, and then let's go see Daryl. I'm actually kind of hungry. <coughs> that is some good chicken. Alright, come on, Blooper. Let's go see how bad this is. That, that's got to be the most inspirational thing I've ever heard, Blooper. You, you truly are an amazing son. You know, just what to say to get me back on my feet. The tides will always fall, and they will always rise again. No truer statement has ever been said. And I am one proud father to call you my son. Oh no, looks like some pretty good damage. Oh, and it's thundering out. Oh my gosh. Blooper, look at... The whole front of the conch command's gone. It's all right. It's all right. Oh, oh, hold your breath. There's a little air pocket there. Be careful. I, it looks like this is a whole air pocket. I don't even think we can get in that entrance. Where's Daryl? Daryl. Daryl. Oh, there he is. All right, let's go see what we have for news. Hey, Daryl. Um, I'm alive. Thanks to Blooper over here. He really, he really helped me out. You know, I they, the doctor said I, I would have been dead if it wasn't for Baby Blooper. 
And I, I just, I don't know. I'm in forever in your debt, baby blooper. But Daryl, did you happen to run into the cannibal crab? I know, um, blooper got out on his own. So, I mean, obviously the cannibal crab didn't, isn't here yet. Unfortunately, the cannibal crab and his men were nowhere to be found, my lord. I searched everywhere. Thankfully, when I returned, Blooper was safe and sound and managed to revive you. Hmm. No sign of the cannibal crab. He just came back to us. Ah, uh, well, that is very odd. So it didn't even look like he took over the city? Uh, I'll, I'll have to look into that when things settled down here. Have you counted up the casualties yet? Yes, sir. It's not good. We lost 183 olithids, 7 turtle tanks, 11 other regular members, with about 215 more injured combined. We have buried all the members except for... Well, I'll let you see for yourself. We lost two generals. Oh no! Where are they? Oh boy, that's not good. Right behind me, my lord. We left them for you to bury and have your final words. Thanks, Daryl. Um, I shall go tend to this at once. Blooper, you, you can come with me if you want. If you don't want to see it, I understand. But we lost two of our generals and I guess they're right over here. All right, let's go see who it is. Oh no, not Larsa! Larsa, bunny old pal. Oh, this is not good, Blooper. Don't look. Why, why don't you wait over here, Blooper? I, I said you could, but I, I don't want you seeing this. Blooper, he was your godfather. And no one deserves to see that. Oh, I guess here's the dirt and the gravestones. Larsa, you were such a good friend, and you were... You were a general probably longer than anyone else that's still serving. And I respect you so much. I'll have to get his favorite plant. Oh, this is not good. Who's the other general? Oh no! It's Carlos. He was actually our newest general. Alright, it's time for Carlos. As I said, he was our newest general. He just got promoted, uh, actually, last week. So now we got them both buried. It's a sad day. There we go. So one thing we do for our generals is, um, we take their favorite kind of tree and we plant it on top of them. Um, I'll have to go grab them from inside. I'll have to find my way inside and hope that they didn't get destroyed. Uh, that way we kind of remember them with it. So, um, that being said, Blooper, you can come with me if you want. We'll go get that and meet him back outside. So let's go find our way in, Blooper. We definitely can't go in this way. So... Because that's all air, and we'd probably die. But we can go in this way. What? What is this? Did they put- they really disrespected us with a flag? Oh, we're gonna burn this. Come back. They put their flag at our conch command. So let me get this right. They steal my baby. My baby blooper. Put him in a cage. They come. Destroy my home. Our home. The Tide Changer's home. And they try taking it over. By putting their little blue flag here. And. They kill me. What. Is going through their mind. That, that penguin is going to pay. He is going to pay for what he's done to us. Alright, Blooper, now we gotta try to make it downstairs. That That's just ridiculous. Uh-oh. Looks like- Oh! We do got- we do got a way to get through, so... Just barely. Oh, look how destroyed everything is. This is crazy. 
Pooper. It's good. Every All the chests are here as long as they didn't loot it, but it doesn't look like they did because they left all the weapons and armor. Alright, so which chest did we put the saplings in? Oh no. Please don't tell- Oh, there they are. Okay. So if I remember right, Larsa was made out of an oak tree. So let's try to get that. Dragon fruit, Medane. Grapefruit, all that. Silver birch. Cyprian deep palm. Um. I'm not seeing it. Oh! There's an oak. An oak sapling. And we're looking for. Pistachio was, um. Carlos's favorite food, so we're trying to find the pistachio one. I saw one over here that was not. No, that's a walnut. And then that one's a cashew. Cinnamon. Chestnut. No. Vanilla. Paper. Pepper. Almonds. No. Pistachio. Okay, there we go. So we got their favorite foods, and. Well, one of their favorite foods. The other one was made out of an oak, so that's why he gets oak. But this is a long tradition. Alright, let's see if we can get back up here. Just be careful, blooper. Be careful, I don't need you dying of oxygen poisoning. There we go. Alright. Here we go, run, 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 run. Larsa. You are a very good friend and leader. We've had many battles together. And your grandfather served my grandfather. And, you know, it's just... I couldn't have asked for a better general than you. You really stepped it up. And you were always there when I needed you. And with this, I hope that we can remember you. And Carlos, though you weren't with us for a while long... We do really appreciate everything you've done for us. And you started becoming a great young general with many talents. And we remember you with your favorite nut, the pistachio nut. Oh, Daryl. I'm done here. I just ask that you, I don't know, maybe put up a gate around here. And I guess we'll have to round up whichever tide changers we can find and start rebuilding. And after that, we have a bonfire to be held. Look what I found at the top of the conch command. It's the dirty flag of Atlantis. We will have to burn it to show them that we will not follow their rules because we are the tide changers and this is our land and just like how blooper reminded me the tides will rise again <laughs> <laughs>